what are embedded data model embedded related data in a single structure or document we want to store our data in a single document in json single document also called denormalized we are not creating or maintaining multiple collections to maintain relationships amongst different entities right so it is one collection which is having data of all the relations or most of the relations in that particular collection in the form of embedded documents normalized data models the second form it uses references for the relations among tables now with this approach if we follow normalized data models in almost all the no sql databases there are no referential constraints or integrity constraints which have been there uh, which can be applied across collections or across tables so in this case when we are talking about references it is more or less like normalized data model which is one table is referring the uh, data in another table which is primary key foreign key kind of relationships right so in that case if we go with this approach application must take care of joins and integrity of the data we will have to take care of all those things at the application level right now question is which one to use when right let me talk about that also embedded data models when to use when there is relationship one to one or one to many relationships are there on the right hand side of the screen you can see that this is embedded model right we have user and we are supposing that one user will have one phone and one email right and access also we can have controlled user will have one level of or a user will have the access defined at a single level only user will not have multiple records of access we can manage those in a single document so that way we can use embedded data model for one to one embed the document in the document meant for query for example a student with one address address can be embedded into the main collection it should not be the other way what will happen in case of one to many again embed the child document in the parent document for example an e-commerce customer with multiple addresses addresses will be a part of main collection which is a customer collection it should not be that we have address collection and there we are embedding customer as a part of because customer is going to be queried most of the time we will not query on addresses we will query on the customer side embedding benefits it will lead to better performances for read operations ability to request and retrieve related data in a single database operation we will not need to have multiple operations to retrieve data from multiple collections make it possible to update related data in a single atomic write operation as well referencing when to use it when embedding leads in duplication of data so there could be the possibility that when you are going to embed the data so it will lead to duplication of data to represent more complex many to many relationships use dollar lookup to join such collections dollar lookup is a mongodb construct which can be used to perform joins across collections this will help to fetch data from the collections where the data is designed in the normalized form so if you see on the right hand side this is an example where we have a user document and we have a contact document and access document so if you see user id is referred inside contact document and access document also so if we want to fetch data we can use dollar lookup Thank you.